Hi, the SI Meteorologist Paul Dorian here on Monday, October 8th. A chilly morning here in the Mid-Atlantic region. Temperatures hovering around the 40 degree mark for morning lows here in southeastern Pennsylvania. And it was quite a chilly day on Sunday with temperatures up and down the I-95 corridor, some 20 degrees below normal with a little bit of rainfall. Quite an impressive cold air outbreak for the last few days. It's 20 degrees below normal here on Sunday and all the way down in the deep south and places and parts of Texas were about 30 degrees below normal over the weekend and late last week they were 30 degrees below normal in Colorado places like Denver for example where they saw their first accumulating snowfall. Let's take a look at the latest surface map. High pressure is in control this morning here in the mid-Atlantic region however quite a bit of moisture has formed in the southeastern part of the country a little bit of tropical influence here, a system developed over the Bahamas over the weekend and has thrown some moisture back in towards the coast and there's rainfall already breaking out in portions of the southeastern part of the country and all of this will take a, a move up to the north and east. Periods of rain will move back in along the I-95 corridor this afternoon, continue tonight and for part of Tuesday. Then we'll turn our attention to the next cold front here. Another strong cold front is pressing southeastward across the northern plains today and that will move all the way across the country may cause a shower or two on Wednesday here in the mid-Atlantic region and Wednesday it'll get a little bit warmer just ahead of the front perhaps touching 70 degrees in some of the big cities but then cool, cooler again for Thursday and Friday behind that cool front as that whips off the east coast by the time Thursday rolls around. Here's the latest uh, radar loop 